practicing the short game. The first thing that I like to establish once we have the stroke down for the chip and run, the pitch, the flop, all of these shots are how far is this ball going? So like Vinny here, he's got a towel down. You know, so, so this shot he has is 30 yards, but he's chipping it to a towel 10 yards away. And then when he goes to the course, he can calculate that distance. If I land this at 10 yards, it'll run out 20. So then you understand the ratios, but you can't say that for every course because you know this shot here is a little bit up, a little bit down. What if he goes to a course where the greens are slower or it's wetter? So it's gonna be, you know, making those adjustments. But the first thing you need to know is how far are you landing this shot? So, you know, put down two golf balls and say, okay, I'm gonna go back you know, two feet back, two feet through to get to my 10 yards and then practice that over and over and know you can land at 10 yards, then practice it at 20 yards. I like to go 10 yards, 20 yards, and then you can hit the in-between ones later. That'd be more detailed, but starting out, know you can land it at 10 yards and then when you go to a certain course, you can practice that shot and know what's my ratio here. is. You know, if, if I hit it 10 yards, is it going to roll 15 yards or is it going to roll 30 yards, you know, with a chip and run nine iron and if it's flat. So there's a lot of calculations to be made, but you need to know first, how far can you land this shot if you go from here to here, get that in, then you can start making those next steps. But this is the first step. Can you land it where you think you need to land it? And that's 10 yards, 20 yards, and then again later, go back to the 5, 10, 15, 20. And then, and then we have like the flop shot here, and you know, obviously this shot is gonna land, Vinny's hitting this one, 20 yards, and it's an L to L, so his 20 yard is gonna land at 20 yards and probably roll five yards. So now we have a four to one ratio. So, but he wants to know, can I land it at 10? Can I land it at 20? And then, later we'll do the calculation so this is the first step of practicing the short game find out where you're landing the ball i like a towel a bucket anything where you can get some feedback on where is that ball landing and then you could do it anywhere just a little nice piece of grass 10 yards that's an easy shot so practicing the short game the first step practice where you're landing the ball where are you going to fly this shot to get those numbers down have it for every shot the chip and run the basic chip the flop the putt chip then you have your calculations so first step learn the shots first step on practicing find your landing point what swing does it take to get this ball to land here put golf balls down same distance back same distance through see how far that goes so like Vinny's hitting this shot it's probably two steps back two steps through landing a nine iron at 10 yards and then his flop shot L to L is 20 so find out what your shot goes on all of those shots and that's the first step to having a really great short game